Okay, so today we're going to be putting a sleeve on this front yoke of a 1976 Chevy Cheyenne Super and it is off of a NP203 um, transfer case. We were getting some leak in here at the bottom here and we went ahead and pulled the, this whole, uh, pulled the drive shaft, the front drive shaft, uh, four wheel drive, drive shaft out and then we went ahead and checked this out and lo and behold we got some grooves in here that are not healthy for the transfer case so we're going to put one of these on there this is a speedy sleeve all it's going to do is just going to replace that metal that was lost there that was already taken off we just going to bang that sucker on there and that's it all you need is a hammer some sandpaper something to clean all this up with not to go too deep or scratch it all crazy because you'll mess it up and the sleeve will slide it won't get it'll just do a bunch of bad things so it's a timekin speedy sleeve pretty much and the part number is kwk99174 and that is from merle's uh automotive supply store um or parts for plus it was about 50 bucks unfortunately this tiny little thing was 50 bucks but anyway we'll go ahead and get right to it all we're going to do is we're going to put the yoke on top of a nice steady surface which is this is nice and steady um clean this up like we said get that sucker pop it on top of there and this is the tool that comes with the sleeve so you put the tool on top of the sleeve there just like so it looks like a little top hat and you get it and then you pop that sucker on bam 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 and then that thing will the speedy sleeve will go all the way down you take the top off this item will be down here all the way at the bottom looking nice and shiny and then uh pretty much you're done pop that sucker back in and that's it so let's go ahead and get to it and try and make this quick for you guys All right, so it's not too bad. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, give it a quick once over and get all this stuff off the bottom there, and uh, make it look right, and stop popping that, start popping that sleeve on. All right, so remember, clean this all up, uh, made it look right, got it all smooth. Um, all right, now comes the fun part. So everything looks good to me, and make sure there's nothing up in here down there and uh, we're gonna make sure the flange part goes down uh, this part's gonna go down here I'm um, gonna try and get this hair snug on there get the top part on there and uh, get to get to hitting it down there just be careful not to hit it too crazy you're supposed to hit it dead in the middle but we're gonna try and cover the whole thing Make sure you don't go crooked, otherwise you'll bend it. And then you'll start to hear a thud, letting you know that it's kind of touching the bottom there. Go around the edge. Make sure it's sealed all right, and it's all the way at the bottom, bottomed out. Pop that sucker off, see what it looks like. Uh, it looks good to me. Doesn't look too bad. And pretty much that's about it. It's not too hard. Uh, just about anybody can do it. It uh, pretty much takes care of itself. So if you got the time, the money to do it, I appreciate you guys watching my video. Hope to help a couple of you because uh, I know uh, uh, aiming to help people, make sure it looks good. All right, so. Appreciate it. You guys have a good day.